Hi, today we're going to talk about the 3 inch fast pipe installation. The 3 inch fast pipe system is made up of an aluminum pipe that is powder coated on the outside and clear anodized on the inside for corrosion protection. The fittings are aluminum die cast and they are a compression style. So they have a stainless steel bite ring and an O-ring for sealing the compressed air. For installation, cut the pipe to any length. We like to use a carbide tip chop saw, which would be something like a wood miter saw, or you can use a wheeled pipe cutter. We don't want you to use a sawzall, hacksaw, things that would have a crooked cut. We want a nice, straight, clean cut. There will be a burr after you cut the pipe. Use the tool that comes with the deburr kit. Take that burr off with this cutter. Then we have an outside chamfer tool. Now this is very important that we chamfer the pipe so that when we shove it into the fitting, the O-ring will go over the top of it very easily. Just use an anti-cordless drill, heavy duty is going to be the best. Take the pipe. After we chamfer the pipe, then we're going to mark how far the pipe goes into the fitting. There is a shoulder in the bottom of the fitting. If you push it in all the way, it will hit that shoulder. We want to make sure that we do have it bottomed out all the way, and a reference mark will help that. We're going to mark that at four and a half inches. Then we're going to use soapy water. Soap the O-ring inside. Do the pipe. After you've soaked the pipe, insert fully into the fitting. You'll see your reference mark disappear. That means that you have it bottomed all the way out. Tighten the fitting. Now you need to use the fast pipe wrenches. One end will lock into the cone nut. The other end has a hook on it that will hook on the fitting on the back side. And all you do is tighten fully. Good pressure is recommended. You can tighten them right up. And that's going to be it. Now you're going to want to air up your system after you have all the joints tight and everything is set. Air up your system. Go to 50 PSI and check for any leaks. If you do find some leaks, go ahead and air down the system, retighten the fittings. Air the system back up to full pressure. And what we like to do is, because of the nature of the large 3 inch pipe, we do like to have the system aired up for 24 hours, air the system back down again, and then go ahead and retighten all the fittings. That'll take out any settling or anything that may have happened with the long piping runs for the 3 inch. So that's it for today. You can check your owner's manual for more installation tips or check the website, rapidairproducts.com. Thank you.